Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I want to take an opportunity to show you guys a couple of new things I've gotten from House of Siage, answer a couple of questions I've received, and talk about what's new at the House of Siage. And I just want to say guys, this video is not sponsored in any way. And this is just a quick reminder, if you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe before you go. Now let's get back to the video. Okay. First things first. So I know I had a regret. There was something that the House of Siage had that I really wanted, but I didn't get it, and I didn't get it, and it sold out. And I was pretty bummed. Until a few weeks ago, when they brought it back. <laughs> it's back. <laughs> The Christian Cohen lipstick bow case is back in stock. So excited. So it comes in this stunning black and white Harlequin print box. House of Siage and Christian Cohen here on the lid. And then you open it and look at that gorgeousness. Look at that presentation. You've got House of Siage and Christian Cohen here on the lid, on the inside as well. Then your white leather case has House of Siage and Christian Cohen. You get a diamond powder, you get a diamond powder lipstick in the shade Baroness. So it has the same white leather case for your lipstick bow, except for this one. Look at this. And then there's the case. Of course, it says House of Siage all the way around it. Of course, it has the crystals all around. But I didn't realize this until I opened this thing. One very unique feature of these bows is that they're numbered. So, your bow is numbered, plus in here, you have a card with your number. Mine happens to be 292 of 300. And then it also comes with a lipstick refill. And it comes with the shade Baroness. Look at that. Which is described as a beige nude with golden luminosity. Let's see if I can get this to swatch or get my camera to cooperate. I know the lipstick will swatch. You see that? Well, I put it in two different places, hoping that the luminosity would come through. It really does have this gorgeous sheen to it. This might be my favorite. You know, for a long time I thought The Whispers of Truth was my favorite. But I, this just speaks to me. This black and white, you know what? I was a teenager in the 80s. Didn't we all have black and white checkerboard vans and the original MTV logo flashing with the black and white checkerboard pattern? Come on. <laughs> this, this speaks to me. Okay. The best thing, House of Siage is still having their 25% off the entire site except for the vaults, of course. So this normally is $225, and right now, because of the sale that they're having, you can get this for $168.75. Stop it, I, I can't. I'm gonna read you a little bit about this collection. I'm just gonna read from the website. This exclusive limited edition collection symbolizes the revolutionary cross collaboration between two worlds, luxury perfumery and, oh God, why? Why have there gotta be words? And I think it's cosmetics in French. Cosmetique, I don't know. Y'all are killing me. Luxury perfumery and cosmetique and haute couture. In collaboration with fashion designer, designer Christian Cohen, House of Siage has released a triad collection comprised of a unisex fragrance, 
Travel Spray and Lipstick Case, lacquered in a black and white checkered design and encrusted with scintillating <laughs> crystals. <laughs> Reflecting the fusion of two industry creatives. House of Siage founder and CEO Nicole Mather shares the story and inspiration behind the collaboration. I met Christian Cohen at one of our events this year in New York City. I was most impressed with how real Christian is as a person and his great heart and passion for design. I felt an instant connection as I, as I also created House of Siage with a similar passion and zest for life and was unencumbered by what existed in our industry but instead wanted to create something entirely new in the fragrance and now beauty world. Christian loves color and sparkle in his designs, as do I, and we both have an affinity for the black and white checkered design. With Christian in mind, we have designed the new limited edition checkered fragrance bottle and checkered travel spray. And stunning, stunning, that's how I described it, stunning. Black and white checkered bow lipstick case. I think this combined collaboration is stunning, super fun, and hot. And I personally would agree. I hope all our customers enjoy this amazing collaboration as it has been an honor and privilege to work with my new friend, Christian Cohen. Well, Miss Mather, I would agree. It is stunning and hot. I love it. And not only can you get it on sale right now, but I, I hadn't noticed this before, that House of Siage offers Afterpay. So you can get this for four payments of $42.18. <laughs> That's a bargain. So this is one of my new things and I love it. I'm, I'm so glad that they made some more of these because I was so bummed that these had sold out and I had not gotten one. They don't have to be anymore. <laughs> And then you still have some. So if you missed out and you were bummed about it, you can still get one. So what else is new at House of Siage, you might wonder? There is another new mystery vault put together by founder and CEO, Nicole Mather. And I think this one sounds the most exciting of any of them so far. It's called the After Dark Fragrance and Beauty Vault by Nicole Mather and there's something about that that's very intriguing for me because I've said before I prefer like a more sultry kind of scent a more innocent patchouli that kind of scent and the description of, of it being a dark just makes me think that oh it would be right up my alley oh, I didn't get her other mystery vault because I had just gotten the Emerald Garden Fragrance Vault. But this one, oh, this one's intriguing me. So the After Dark Fragrance and Beauty Mystery Vault retails for $954. That's a lot. And you can get the vault with the Afterpay for four payments of $238.50. Now just like the previous Mystery Vault, that Miss Mather put together. This one comes with one of the limited edition fragrances <laughs> that are value, valued at $1,210 and one of the lipstick cases valued at $198. And obviously other goodies that remain a mystery because I don't know what they are. So in addition to that vault, which every time I think this will be the pinnacle of all vaults, then come out with another one. It's never ending, House of Siage. They're constantly topping themselves. Are you kidding me? Anyway, they still have the Infinite Love for Her Fragrance and Beauty Vault that is $296 and valued at $593. They still have the Island Escape Mystery Fragrance and Beauty Vault, which is $330 and valued at $673. They still have the Bold Confidence Mystery Fragrance and Beauty Vault, which is $339 and valued at $682. I got that one. It was fabulous. And they still have the Emerald Garden Mystery Fragrance Vault, which is $498 valued at $1,025. I also got that one. It was really good. And 
what else is new, right? So they've put together these gift sets, right? So one of them, the Cherry Blossom Beauty and Fragrance gift set, you get one of the signature Cherry Garden perfumes, one pink lipstick bow, and one of the Diamond Satin lipstick refills in the shade King. That's a $593 value, but you only pay $415 for it. Then another gift set that they've put together is the Ethereal Rose Beauty and Fragrance set for her, which in this this set you get one of the Chevaux d'Or, or Chevaux d'Or? <laughs> I should say it with confidence like I know what the hell I'm saying. Chevaux d'Or Signature Perfume. You get the Ruby Travel Spray Case and four of the eight mil refills for it. In the same scent, you get a black lipstick bow case and one of the diamond powder satin lipstick refills in the shade Duke. That is a $963 value for $674. If you saw anything about the last mystery vault that Nicole Mather put together, you know that they now have a faux mink throw and you knew they had a candle. Well now they have two new candle scents. Oh, I don't have one of the candles, but I've seen video of the candle with people just raving about how good these candles smell. They now have the By the Lagoon candle, which the description says it has notes of sea musk, golden sand, almond flower, and dewy fig. Oh, that sounds really good. They have the Vanilla Sun candle, which has fruity notes of sun-kissed, wild strawberry, and dark cherry. And they have the Endless Tropics candle, which is infused with the essence of amber, dark musk, and a hint of teak wood and peppercorn. Oh, that sounds really good too. All of the candles are soy based. They are eight ounces, have a 60 hour burn time, and they retail for $60. And it's been mentioned to me that there's still some more new stuff to come later this month and closer to the beginning of June. And I, for one, cannot wait to see what that is. I'm, I'm just really excited to see what, what they're gonna offer and I'm gonna have to get one of these candles. I really like candles. I'm gonna have, oh uh, yeah, if not all of them. How will I decide? I don't know. But I'm definitely most excited about this new mystery vault, this After Dark Fragrance and Beauty Vault. I love the idea that you can now get a vault with a limited edition because those limited edition perfume bottles just look stunning. True works of art. And speaking of limited edition perfume bottles, the other new thing that I got. I'm gonna get through this. I don't know Nicole Mather. Um, wow, I'm gonna get through this. But in some small way, I feel like I do. Because she, she did one of the most unbelievably kind things for me recently. Um, If you've seen some of my other videos, I had gotten an Emerald Rain um, signature scent in my <laughs> uh, Bold Confidence Mystery Vault. And in looking at stuff for the vault, you know, looking at Emerald Rain, I came across a, a picture of the limited edition Emerald Rain and just thought it was the most just unbelievably stunning thing. And um, recently I got a surprise package in the mail. And in the package, was a box and in the box was this gorgeous 
white lacquered wooden <sighs> box <sighs> that has this amazing spring latch and inside of the lacquered box was this. <sighs> um, Nicole Mather gifted me This limited edition, wow, Emerald Rain perfume. And also included a, a, a beautiful handwritten note, which I'm not going to read to you. I'm going to keep that for myself. Um, I, I'll just say part of it does say, um, thank you for your enduring kindness towards me in the house of Sihaj. Um, and yeah, that's all I want to share, but, um, so like I said, I don't know Nicole Mather, but I know that it takes a very special person to do something like this for someone that they don't know at all. And, um, I think it speaks volumes <laughs> to who she is and therefore who, what her company is and what her company stands for. Um, I'm going to stop talking about this though or I won't get through the rest of this video. Um, I just want to say to Miss Mather and everyone at the House of Siage, there are no words to thank you enough for this kindness. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to show this to you guys because she's so stunning. He, I think of all animals is he's. Oh, but look at this. Hopefully his eyes are coming through. His eyes are emerald. He has an emerald stone here on his collar. Oh, it's just gorgeous. I'll insert some better images than what I can show you guys right now. Oh my goodness. Oh, and then of course on the cap, it's House of Siage, and it's numbered. Um, but yeah, this is the other new thing that I got. And like I said, I can't talk about this anymore. Ooh, my face didn't get too streaky. You know, we have to worry about those things, right? So I got asked by one of you all about the travel case refills and the trend refills. And I was asked by a subscriber recently about the travel spray cases and the trend cases. And would the refills for the travel spray fit in the trend cases and vice versa? And my answer to them was yes. This is what I found and I'm gonna kinda see if I can show you. So this is Holt Bayou refill from a travel case. And this is trend number seven. So the Hope Bayou goes in here in the trend, but it's, hopefully you can hear that, it's a little looser than this. And it will fall out. The trend refill will go in the travel case, but it is snug. But it, it will go in there. So you can put either refill in either type of case, but if you put the signature refills in your one of your trend cases, it's gonna be a little loosey-goosey. So if you do that, don't turn it upside down. 
just be very careful with it. But you can use these to put signature scent refills in and it'll be, I think it'll be fine. Um, <laughs> just, it, it might fall out if you're not very, 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 very careful. If you forget that you have one of the signature refills in there and you turn it the wrong way, it might just fall out. So yeah, I think you could get away with um, interchanging the refills. Just don't forget that you've done that. So the other thing a subscriber has asked me is if I would show my House of Siage collection. And I'm not gonna sit here and hold everything up and talk about it. I'm just gonna show you guys some footage. Okay guys, well that's it for this video. I just wanted to hop on and show you the couple of new things I had gotten from House of Siage, tell you about what new things they had to offer, and um, answer a couple of questions I had received. And once again, I just wanna say thank you, Miss Mather and everyone at the House of Siage. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, Please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe before you go. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves, stay safe. And until next time, bye-bye.